Hey, so gave myself a little haircut last night. We've got a we made a little harvest list right here for what we're going to pick for the farmers market. We're going to East Atlanta Village tonight. Um, I'll just run down the list of what we're going to harvest. Let's see how quickly I can do this. Squash, cucumber, rubula, golden frills, squash blossom, shishito, cupid peppers, tons of herbs, marigolds, zinni zinnias, go through tomatoes again, delicata, butternut. That's what we got to pick today. Well, I hit something out here and now my car is squeaking everywhere we go. I don't know if maybe the brakes finally need changing or if like we broke a wheel bearing or something, you know. But we're probably just going to keep driving this thing. We might take that front wheel off and look at the brakes here when we get time. So as I'm picking these yellow squash, I'm kind of sorting them out by size. So big ones definitely go to the farmer's market. Two big ones go to the ground. And the ones that are two inches or so go on this side for restaurants. Got all the squash. Hi, I'm Grant, and this is Absinthe Tea, made with wormwood, lemon balm, and anise hyssop. I was inspired by Absinthe to make a nice non-alcoholic tea using some of the same botanicals that are used traditionally to make real absinthe. So this is obviously just a herbal tea. There's no alcohol in here, right? It's loose leaf tea. The retail price on this is $10. It's available at the farmer's markets that we attend as well as Pure Quill Superette on Memorial in uh, Atlanta. Take a look. That's the squash we just picked. I say it's about 100 pounds, honestly. Ladies. Let me show you a trick. It helps get things done, you know? You mean reading? Yep. Rick. Rick roll. This is the rickety roll. We're picking some really premium arugula right now. All right, we just finished harvesting that bed. We've got tons of super premium first cut arugula. So right now we're picking some golden frills, some mustard green, very spicy. Some people call them wasabi greens. Now we're gonna cool off these greens and kind of clean them a little bit with putting a bunch of cold water in here. All right, well we got everything packed up. Um, you know, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm gonna enjoy my little pickled okra here.